And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast. Weather from where you live. All right, you'll need that coat on this morning. It is cool out there. Temperatures lower uh, 40s to mid to upper 30s. 39 Lafayette, 40 Delphi, Monticello, 35 here this uh, 515 hour, 35 Frankfurt. Down in Attica sitting at 38, so there might be a little bit of patchy frost across the viewing area. Most areas underneath a frost advisory goes until 9 o'clock, so just more sign to tell you that uh, it's pretty cool out there. Be sure to get their jacket on, hat, gloves on the kiddos at the bus stop. Satellite radar, we are all clear thanks to high pressure to the east. Have some mid-high level clouds from a storm system to our west. All the rain will stay north of us, but we'll see some of the upper level clouds from this throughout the rest of the day, but it will be nice and sunny regardless. A very nice day. Get outside and enjoy it. We'll be at 57 by lunchtime and then for the drive home dinner time 67 degrees and it will get rather windy and then it just really kind of gets stays and gets windy from here on out. Tomorrow will be a very breezy day with south southwest winds gusting up to 30 35 miles per hour at times. But look at the temperatures for tomorrow 70 by lunchtime. That south wind really bringing in that warm air. 78 for a high tomorrow, partly sunny by the end of the day. And you'll see that here on future cast, but today you can notice those high and mid-level clouds kind of streaming through. Here's 3 o'clock, so that's south-southeast wind. Shift a little bit more to the south and southwest by tomorrow. We'll start off clear, definitely not as cold as this morning. But then as we get toward the afternoon, more clouds will start to work in. And then we'll see kind of round one of rain for this week starting Wednesday morning. Could be a wet commute for us for the middle of the week, 730. See some showers, maybe a rumble of thunder or two. That'll get out of here by oh, probably midday. And then we'll stay fairly cloudy by the evening, but still hold on to that southwest wind. And then we talk about more rain chances and storms later this week. So Thursday may be a mostly to partly cloudy day, but it'll be warm too. Still in the 70s. Main area of a warmer air up to the or the warm front moving northward, cold fronts to the west, but it's an interesting situation coming along here. Thursday night into Friday may see a round of showers and storms. Friday throughout the day may see some scattered showers and storms as well going into Saturday, even into Sunday. Monday we could be watching for some showers and storms, so kind of an interesting setup here. Could be watching for some several rain chances, but as we get toward Monday, Tuesday, cold air will filter in and we're talking probably highs only in the 40s early next week. So I think these totals underdoing it by Monday morning. I think we could see close to maybe one pushing three inches of sustained rain uh, throughout to some of the periods of rainfall that we will have come Wednesday even into a Thursday evening, Friday scattered storms, but temperatures this week not too bad, well above normal. Normally we're about 61 degrees this time of year, but we'll be well in the 70s all week long. But watch what happens here Saturday, Sunday. We will be in the 60s, 50s on Sunday. And it looks like we'll be seeing some 30s and maybe highs only in the 40s come Possibly Tuesday, Wednesday of next week, Joe. Mm, wow, yeah, just a beautiful stretch of weather yeah. we're going to have. I love that. Yeah, not too bad. You know, other than the rain chances, yeah. uh, we're definitely going to be seeing uh, very warm air the next several days, but the next week, mm -hmm. right in time for Halloween. I know, right? Yeah. Unfortunately, it seems like all every year it's been very cold, but uh, you know, next week, definitely mm. going to get cold. Okay, can't get any of that warm weather for Halloween. That's no, no. too bad. All right, well, thanks, David. <laughs>